And now, as promised last time, we go into the hole. Let's go! What could it be? What More enemies, be I imagine. A mid-boss, perhaps. Oh, it's a new area. Yeah, another area. Here we go. All the I areas in this all the areas in this look very distinct from each other. Are we in a skull? What are we inside? We're inside something weird. So this is a portal that would take us up. I didn't mean to press it. <laughs> oh well. Hey guys, get another look at the Great Crevice really fast. Great yeah, crevasse. Look at it. Great crevice. You can get another look at it. Here it is. Look nice. At the gummy blocks. Back inside. <laughs> My bad. Okay. So this area uh, is interesting. So there's nothing in this one. Hey, no, I looked kind of like a it skull. Looks like a skull, sort of, because these things look kind of like teeth. I'm sure that was intentional, but Probably. we're going to touch this next one and uh, get teleported over to a similar station over here. But this one has a big evil portal coming out of it. What's up with that? Let's have a look at. Uh, let's have a look and see. I imagine it's going to be an arena. Of, I, I'm getting all these wrong. Jeez. Oh, wait, we're back in it's an, and it's, It is an arena. You're right. Okay, it is yeah. an arena. It's not for a boss, necessarily. Yeah. So, why are we back in Traverse now if we're on the end of the world? Whoa, these are these are stations for worlds that haven't been destroyed yet. This is where they're gonna go and when the Heartless get them. They're waiting, plotting and waiting, waiting and plotting. Oh, cool. I mean, well, no, not cool. But... I don't think that's ever, like, explicitly stated, but that's, like, that's that's the that's the accepted statement of, like, what this is, is it's, is it's the worlds that the Heartless are eyeing but haven't gotten yet. Well, we closed it though, like they can't. Anymore. Yeah, exactly. So it's it's a bit odd, but it's like you know, it's just like this. We will like it's. I guess it's a reminder of the stakes. You know, like this is what you're fighting for, I suppose. True. And maybe it's also called padding. <laughs> yeah. And not making new areas, but whatever. Doesn't matter. I can live with it. Besides, yeah, it should turn make sense because it's like I mean, maybe they wouldn't just take the portal away immediately. Like, who I knows what on, it takes? I think I should turn on treasure magnet. Actually, I don't think I have a single treasure magnet on for sure. I should remove something else. I'll take off, uh, how much does treasure magnet cost? Two? Let's talk costs two that I can remove. I'll remove Blitz, because I have a bunch of other finishing moves now that I can use instead, so that's good. So, this, uh, Spirit Gem, wait, that's not, hold on, where's the other, is there another chest in here somewhere? That doesn't seem right. What Spirit Gem? It's a, a crafting thing, I think. Um, synthesis thing. Maybe, oh, I think you get it when you leave. Let's see. Maybe that's right. No? Weird. Huh. Now I'm confused. Well, let's move on. Let's see if I let's keep going and I'll see if I'm let's see if I can remember or not. Okay, go in here. Next one. Now we're back in here. Oh yeah, you didn't see this because it was during the music episode, but basically like so this is this is the um uh, this is the first save point for Wonderland. Like this is where you enter. Oh, and, there's, okay. and, there's, there's, and there's a save point, you're just like the rabbit hole. Uh in this game, uh once the whole like, you know, the keyhole at the Hollow Bastion is open or whatever, and the worlds get way more dangerous. If you come back here, you didn't get to see it obviously yet because you haven't reviewed the, you haven't seen the music episode. But basically, when you come back into this room, uh, okay, when you come back in like along that hallway, if you don't if you don't like load in from here, if you just walk in here from you know another room, right? Uh, you'll come in and you'll come around that corner and you'll see the save point. But when you get to here. The save point will vanish and enemies will spawn in, and you have to beat them before the save point will appear. Oh, that's cool. And the, and the first time you do it, there's a special treasure chest appears to give you something. Thunder Gem. Maybe this was changed in Final Mix? Because I'm really, like, this is not what it's supposed to be. In the original version, when you do all of these, you get a copy of the item that you got for beating the boss of that world originally. Really? Like, what, whatever accessory you got, whatever piece of armor you got, it will give you another one. Oh. Um, so I guess they changed that in its synthesis items now. They, they changed a lot of item placements and spawns in, um, uh, in Final Mix. Um, that wasn't actually an issue, because when I was looking up stuff for the music episode, stuff that I was getting, uh, some stuff was in different places, uh, because of the, um, uh, because of, whatchamacallit, uh, because it was on, because I'm playing the Final Mix version, stuff got moved around. Right. So this is interesting. Uh, we never get to play in the outside of the arena when it's this time of day. We only get to see it in, like, a cutscene or two. Yeah. Uh, so this is the only space where this is actually playable, like, this, th when you see it at this time of day. Um, which is, or I guess time of night. Which is interesting. You get, you, like, obviously, when you're in the actual arena, you see it at all different times of, uh, day and right. night. But, uh, this is the only time you can play the exterior at anything other than broad daylight. Which is cool. So yeah. it's not, not quite a carbon copy. It's at least, a. Especially since these games didn't have dynamic lighting, this is probably a separate room file, you know? Yeah. This is a completely separate file, I imagine. 
like any kind, like as long as it's not the exact like copy paste, like any kind of differentiation is always nice. Yeah, a little bit cool, especially because you can come back to these, yeah. you can visit these again, so you can come and fight here again if you're so inclined. You just don't get the world's music, you get the uh, end of the world music, which is phenomenally good. Yes, it is. The music for here is really good. Ah, oh, awesome. Oblivion just looks. We got that cool black. Yeah, sweep. no, it's like its effects are probably not that. It might be my favorite Keyblade, honestly, like in this game so far. Doop, doop. Frost gems. I guess they're all replaced with synthesis. They're all re they are all replaced with synthesis items now. Jacob can speak, you guys. Did you know that that Jacob has mastery of the English language? But yeah, or if the, you can examine these still. The Keyblade, like. There's a plenty of them no, that look okay. cool, but, like, this one's designed coupled with, like, the black and blue streaks. Like, I think, yeah, so far, yeah, I'd say it's my favorite. Okay, back out. Oh, I guess I gotta take the other door out. Okay. All right. I'm on my way. I'm going. That and the black stars are cool. Mm -hmm. All right, next one. Next up is Agrabah, I think. Wow. Let's see. Or we haven't done Deep Jungle yet, have we? So maybe it's no, Deep Jungle. Yeah, no. It's Deep Jungle, yeah. Okay. This is the one that I remember, because I always, I always remember that the item you get from the boss on this place is the one you get from Sabor, which is uh, White Fang. So if it's not White Fang, then I'll know that they've changed it, because this is the one that I always like actually remember the name of like what the particular item. Right. Um. Anyway, I'm, pr I'm pretty confident now that we've like, been to the other ones that they must have changed it all to synthesis items. I need to equip a few more treasure magnets, because I'm still not picking these up quite as much as I wish I was. <laughs> I like having Love Source combat abilities, though. We're far enough away from it that she wasn't in combat with us. Alright, she's dead now. Just keep throwing your monkeys at us, I'm sure it'll work. Yeah. Eventually. Uh, it's working. See, look, you're, you're, you're hurting. See, look, you've got so little health and so little magic. Okay, I took a little bit of damage there. Donald took some damage. Actually, no, Donald didn't even take damage. That's his MP. <laughs> Goofy's the only one who took damage. He took a hit somewhere in that mess. Bright gem. Yeah, okay, so I guess they replaced it with, with synthesis items. I don't think I've seen, like, half of these synthesis items that we're getting for this. Uh, I don't know if we have, because I know I know for a second we had, like, a thunder thing, like, our, like thunder spark or something like that. And I know we don't have any, because you need it for, like, it seems like we need it for every single synthesis thing in the synthesis shop, because I went by to try to make stuff, and I couldn't, so. <laughs> uh, I was very upset. I was like, where do I get these from? Oh, yeah, I forgot. This, uh, this uh, once again, remember how when we fought the one boss here, like, the whole area was one area all of a sudden? Yeah. This is the only other time you can get it to spawn like that. Cool. I completely forgot. So, yeah, you can get the entire area to spawn as one area for whatever reason. The mysteries of Kingdom Hearts that will never be answered. Hey, it's cool, though. You know, you can't get to any of these other areas anymore, but, like, you can technically navigate this entire place as one space. It's just very confusing to me as to why and how. Ah, uh, who knows. That's alright. Anything around here? Is the treasure up here? I guess the treasure must be at the end of the, uh, main area. In fact, yeah, we aren't, we, like, I've probably, probably made some enemies not spawning. I might have to backtrack through there really fast to make sure I spawn all those guys properly. Maybe. Wah! There we go. Very nice. Fire armor. Get him! Get him! There we go. I think Donald and Goofy have lucky. I need to check that. I need to make sure they have lucky strike on because there's plenty. Like we can get good stuff from this place. I need to make sure they have lucky strike equipped. All right. I guess we spawned everyone in there. I need to double check that. Make sure these guys have lucky strike on. Sora doesn't get with our since we picked the uh, sword for Sora doesn't get lucky strike for ages, but he's good. What would he get it from normally? Magic or uh, or shield or defense? You get it a bit earlier on both of the other ones. Okay. Um, I don't know what exact levels you get it on. Where is? Hold on. It's uh. Lucky strike. Okay, we're good. All they right. both have it on. That's the best we can do right now. Increases drop rate of, you know, rare items and stuff. That's the best I can ask for at the moment. We should just one-shot them. Close, anyway. It's one shot at a bunch of people in the arena. I guess these guys are a bit tougher than that. In Coliseum, that is. I one-shot at a bunch of people with gravity. Okay, cool. Blaze gem. Uh, where's chest? Where is the chest hiding? Do some parkour. It's parkour. Up top somewhere. Parkour. Parkour. There we yeah. go. Yeah. It's kind of funny though because like the uh, this door over here is blocked up, but it's that door just leads to the other side of this wall. Like it just it, Why, just it comes was out. blocked up over here too, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it just it just comes out up there where that where that gate is. Oh, okay. Cool. Because that space just isn't rendered, I guess. So whatever. It's just kind of funny. We can keep going now. Uh, yeah, there we go. Back out in the back out in the desert, which is actually uh, another location. My hand is kind of in front of my mouth right now because I'm scratching myself. Uh, so my voice sounded weird there. That is why. That's covering my mouth somewhat. In. 
A lot of people don't like it when you go like backtracking to previous worlds, like for a final level. I like it a lot, honestly. Like I like being. It's it, okay. Sometimes it doesn't work. But as long game, as as like, long as there's way way more new stuff, then yeah, then then okay, the yeah. then the sense of recap can be fun. Like exactly. the sense of. Especially when it's a game like this where it's like the journey is really important, like you know, you're, it's like a sense of progression and you're going like forward through all these worlds and seeing all these new places. Right. Then definitely, I think I think that seeing this stuff is valuable. Like I said, reminds you of the stakes somewhat. Uh, if, if you're if you're taking the story really seriously. Yeah. I just got pushed up to the top. That's not good. It back down. The, uh, the big fish. Back down. Hit. Back down. Wait, which one's O's oh, down? Isn't it? Yeah, O's down. Oops. Oh well. Nah, not oh well. I need to get back in there. I need to get back in there and fight the power. I don't really remember those fish monsters much. Uh, we didn't see too many of the big ones, no. We saw lots of these guys, but we didn't see oh, yeah. too many of the big round shark looking things. Any of these jellyfish things. I didn't even realize that, like, they're, you can see their face under there. Like, uh, you can see their head before, but uh, they're smiling under the yeah. little dome. Yeah, underneath, the, underneath the bubble. Get him. There we go. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's what gravity does. It pushes them flat on the ground, like I mean, uh, like make... lay flat from Final Fantasy VII. It would make sense, but it's just kind of funny looking. Yeah, it is funny looking. Gravity's great. <laughs> Bam! I'm done. Okay, uh, is that it? Sweet. Treasure. Down. Sora. 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 Yeah. There we go. Use your key. You can do it. AP up. Nice. Very good. I will pause and use that on Sora, I guess, because clearly I was just juggling like which things I could equip to him, so might as well use it on him. Yeah. Stock. AP up. Sora. Sora. All right. Forward. Next. Uh, next station. Let's just go over here and have a look back out through for. Oh no, up there. So like we can see a bunch of these other stations around here, kind of. Uh, out in the distance, yeah. Yeah, that we've, that we've come from. There's the last one we just came from. Only renders. Only renders two of them at a time, I suppose, or at least three. I guess three of them, because we can see the one ahead of us. Renders two of the two nearest ones, renders the uh, beam of dark that goes up. Right. Oh boy. I forgot, I, for, I totally forgot that you could get back in this room. I, was, I thought I thought I used the um, uh, the area like where the, after the mansion has been destroyed as this uh, as this space. I totally forgot you could get back in here. Yeah, this this is awesome, because you can get to a bunch of areas you can't access otherwise. Like, you get Agrabah as one continuous stage, you get, you get, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, Olympus Coliseum at night, and you get the casino board again. In fact, you get the casino board as it, as it doesn't even appear in the uh, in the boss fight because it hasn't yeah, been it hasn't been lowered. Bottom. It hasn't been lowered. Awesome! I totally forgot about this. Man, this game is good. <laughs> they made the good game. They made it. They did it. They did a decent job. The boogie's not here though. No, we killed him. Yeah, he's gone. He turned into a house and then we killed him. <laughs> that it. Can we stand on Oogie Boogie's healing station and heal ourselves? No. We're not evil enough. Oh well. We look kind of evil, but we're not evil enough. Yeah, we've transformed into our evil forms, sort of. Do, do. Bring! Alright. That's that. Moving on. Onwards! Look at how, like, I don't know, again, again, it's just like the, the attention to detail in terms of how these things look. Uh, the fact that it looks all metal. You know, like it's more real life than cartoony, and everything is kind of curved a little bit. Like, just the, I, I, it just you know, similar to the art of the film. Yeah, it puts well, a, lot, a lot of attention to detail in making these look like the movies, which is great. Uh, moving forward, next station. Like, it's a, that's a very important thing with this kind of game. You know, where it's go. based off of the multiple films. Yep. 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 All right, can I fly? I cannot fly in here. All right. Oh. Oh well. You can oh, wait, glide, don't go through so. the door. That's weird because that that door we can actually see what's on the other side of it, but we're not actually getting, like it'll actually spawn us back in the, the end of the world. So weird, bit weird. No, Sora, Sora. Okay. Yeah. That time I grabbed a ladder in the middle of gliding. Uh, Maybe it was just those other ones. Oh, okay, oh, there we go. Okay. Wondering what was going on. They surprised me. They ambushed me. Well, they surprised me by the door closing and the camera being outside of the door. <laughs> and now I can jump through here, which we can't even do in like the normal thing. But whatever. Okay, now this door's open. Uh, guys, where are you? Is that it? Is it? That can't I be it. Maybe they're gonna jump me after I open this. Obtain Goofy's mighty shield. Is that his ultimate? No, that no it's, not, it's not his ultimate. It's not very ultimate looking, so yeah. Small but power, pow small power, most, the most powerful shield, small but effective. That is not the most, like, that's not his ultimate weapon. 
Unless it's unless that's a final mix thing, because I mean, again, you get you used to get the items from the bosses, and that's obviously not. So maybe that is the strongest one in final mix. I don't know, but whatever. Goofy's strong now. Nice. Goofy's stronger anyway. And uh, yeah, I guess that was the only that was the only enemies that spawned in here. Very good. Back outside. Nice and quick. This one's green. Is this the last one or something? Uh, not quite. There's a. Oh. Well, yeah. Okay, this one is uh, green because it's Winnie the Pooh. Hey! It is, you know, not evil, and you get a Mega Elixir for no cost, and you get a save point. That Would you be able that. to come here, like, if you hadn't completed the world? Uh, yeah, you could. Okay. Mm. Yep. All these all these exist no matter what, uh, you know, your, um, no matter what you've done. Okay. Because you do, you do technically have to give the book to Merlin, even though you don't have to enter. So you, you, right. have, you have to be made aware of its existence. And you don't know what it is, so there's really no reason not to hit triangle on it unless you just like are like, no, I don't care. Yeah, it's just, it's kind of weird to me that it would be a heartless portal in a place where the heartless can't get to. Yeah, that is odd. I, I agree, it's a bit strange. I Again. mean, I guess they could, but they haven't. Whoa! The stick was stuck. I almost ran in there before I was ready. <laughs> So yeah, that is odd, because I mean, like, again, I don't think there's like an ex official explanation as to what any of these things are. So maybe the theory about, you know, like the stations where things are going to go doesn't make sense for that one. I don't know. Anyway. This so, one looks pretty evil, and it is this, the this, last one. This one, cannot, this one cannot be skipped. This one looks absurdly evil. You are right. And it's making evil sounds. Let's go inside. It's really goes fast before they start doing their teleporty thingy. I don't like them. I don't like them when they do their teleporty thingy. Get is this Sword. Hall Bastion or is it just a unique place? Uh, this is, well, hold on a second. We'll get that after I kill these guys. Okay. Stick good. Come here. Come here. Okay, he's he's teleporting. Never mind. Get the other one. Wow, that is an evil looking portal back. Maybe that's what the other ones look like, but we couldn't see them or whatever. No, because so. you just go through doors, so... Right, no, but what no I'm saying on. is, like, beyond that door. Okay, maybe, maybe you're right. Alright, so... That door just opened, but one second. So, we got a Heartless logo here. Yeah. It's, uh, really... just seems like it's preventing us from moving forward, because, uh... It's just kind of paper thin and yeah. floating in space. So it's implied more space here. But yes, this is Hollow Bastion, but it's an area we couldn't cannot get to otherwise. This is a unique area of Hollow Bastion. Okay. With some stuff inside here. Huh. Huh, indeed. That's a well, that, here. that certainly is evil looking. Is that, oh, uh, I guess princesses could go in there? Maybe? Uh, Somebody mm, could. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. So not quite princesses. Okay. But somebody could go in there, that's for sure. Is Back. anybody in any of them? Doesn't look like it. But, uh, you never know. Could be someone invisible in there. Oh, yeah, Ooh, I suppose. Spooky. Spooky. Thinking somebody invisible Spook. could be in this room right now. <gasps> Ones born of the heart and darkness, devoid of hearts, ravage all worlds and bring desolation. Seize all hearts and, co and consummate the great heart. All hearts to be one, one heart to encompass all. Realize the destiny, the realm of kingdom hearts. The great darkness sealed within the great heart. Progeny of darkness come back to the e e eternal darkness. For the heart of light shall unseal the path. Seven doors, one keyhole, one key to the door. The door of darkness tied by two keys. The door of darkness to seal the light. None shall pass but shadows returning to the darkness. Ones born of the heart and darkness, hunger for every heart until the dark door opens. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of information right there. A lot of information. And I might have missed did I misread any of it? Yeah, you reading a along with me? Great, I'm glad. <laughs> That's exactly what I was hoping. Misreading the most important thing in this entire freaking game. <laughs> Alright, they're dead. Let's have a look at this again. Can we? That was weird. It, well, it wasn't for a second. Yeah, okay. Once born of the heart and, dar uh, and darkness, devoid of hearts, ravage all worlds and bring desolation. Seize all hearts and consummate the great heart. All hearts to be one, one heart to encompass all. Realize the destiny, the realm of kingdom hearts. The greater, the great darkness sealed within the great heart. Progeny of darkness come back to the eternal heart. From the heart of light, 
for the Heart of Light shall unseal the path. Seven hearts, one keyhole, one key to the door. The door of darkness tied by two keys. The door of darkness to seal the light. None shall pass but shadows returning to the darkness. Ones born of the heart and darkness hunger for every heart until the dark door opens. It's important to read it twice because you see, well, I mean, at least to read it and make sure we have it, because when you go back through here, uh, that portal is closed forever. Oh. You cannot go back there ever again. You said ever... we can go down. Yeah, we can go down now. Anyway, that was about, that was an episode's worth, pretty much, so I'm going to cut that there. Uh, if anybody wants to read that whole thing again, I'm, I, I hopefully I'll remember to write it in the description. Uh, in case you want to try and wrap your head around it a little bit more, though, of course, we won't really understand it until honestly, after this game, even. That was kind of... That that scene was the most sequel teasy that this game is. Okay. Um, but anyway. Uh, yeah, that's the end of this record. That's the end of this episode. See you all next time as we go down into the... That. That.